I mean, it's a good pick. Change your Especially name. Especially off game one. Change, change your name. Oh, man. He's not going to change no, his no, name. No, 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 no. Okay, okay. Tweak got it. Tweak got him. <laughs> good guy, Tweak. Let's go. Tweak with the awareness. Too true. We, I have seen an egregious amount of Game & Watch today. Not even you're like... Gonna, you're going to see more because there's oh yeah. more Game & Watches in the building. We have Meister here. Yep, Meister was playing it. Zachary was playing it in doubles. Uh, Paper's here. He's a SoCal uh, Game & Watch. So there's a good number of uh, 2D fans here. All right, so now we're going to get uh, Tweak versus uh, Snooper. Let's see if uh, Snooper can uh, pull off the upset right now. Okay, I like the patient play coming out. Can Game Watch Tweak? Can, can Game Watch bucket guns? No, it's okay. I, I don't believe it's an energy. Okay. I think it's psychic damage. All right. Okay, a little bit of neutral being played. Yeah, I like that. Okay, you see my man says Snooper getting his damage in. Very, very nice. You know, taking a going for the bread and butters with Game and Watch. Very smart. Okay, here we go. There's the down throw. Immediately using the up B to make sure that Tweet cannot have the fair follow up. Especially like being that distance above the platform could have been like a drag down fair, which would of course just extended the combo even much further. Arsene is here. Yeah, dad's home, so you actually might die at 70. Oh yeah. One well one well play smash attack or <laughs> an aerial off stage, you might you might say bye bye to that stock. Mm -hmm. Okay, there's a forward throw. Starting to set up for the guns. Where's the back airs at the ledge? There it was. But, okay, kind of lets him just, you know, get back. Oh, yeah, you're gone, my butt. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Yo. Yeah. Joker is that character, bro. Yeah, put that, put the game and watch in the recycling bin. That, that stock is gone. Here we go. And uh, these plats doing, uh, doing a lot. And, yep, waiting for him to come down. Just trying to catch his landings here, but... Here we go. We see Snooper putting a little, a little bit of damage on him. He's a 98. You know what I'm saying? Could get the kill here. Okay, I like that. I mean, Snooper's playing so patient for, for a yeah. game and watch. He's really trying to uh, have Tweak be the aggressor. Yeah. And, but Tweak is not having it. <laughs> He's really just, you know, playing a strong neutral game. Yeah, and Rebel's Guard kind of just eliminating that kill option for game and watch. He saw him try to fair earlier. Not going to get it here, but uh, he's getting real close to having Arsene again. And ironically enough, this man uh, is back in kill percentage. Ooh. Nah, you, you tempted fate with that one. Yeah, but, you know, Arsene is out. Now it's time to play the look for the game and watch kill game. And wow, okay. I think that was a down smash that traded with uh, Arsene's back air. Okay, get, gets the kill with the forward smash, though. So stock ahead for Tweak. Snooper. Unfortunately, that, uh, I mean, it traded with him, but he just, you know, got hit with that uh, that forward smash after the fact, so. Yeah. Getting hit by Aha is probably the worst feeling for a player who was trying to play a more neutral, heavy game, because that's just dot damage. It's, that's a free 20% that's going to eventually happen. Right, and then it just bears the question, like, how am I supposed to play neutral against, <laughs> against Joker if I'm getting damaged anyway, but getting a little get too egregious on the recovery, forward smash, not killing just yet. Yeah, game lies sometimes. <laughs> okay, another F2 at the left, but the ejection button's gonna get Snooper out of the hot seat. And you know, playing a couple up airs. Very smart use of Rebels Guard, gonna make sure to get a little bit more meter, get Arson out here, and get back to the stage at the same time. That's a three for one deal, you can't pass that up. Yeah, man, that's, a, that's that bargain right there. I'm trying to hit him with the Lion Tamer, put a little space for him on stage, but I mean, it's a, it seems like it's just a matter of time. I mean, even falling guns, such a good approaching tool for Joker. And Snooper wasn't even able to challenge that. Usually we see those game watches really opting for the up B as soon as uh, a character is applying pressure to the shield and they're relatively close. But even then, what didn't work. I mean, uh, he, tried to, he tried to play neutral. I respect that Snooper tried to play neutral and he tried to like go for a, a less aggressive approach than uh, you know trying to get like Tweak to come over here and fight him. But like once Tweak that got that stock lead it's just like you really have to switch up the way you play against something like that and unfortunately snooper uh didn't cut the mustard quite yet but still has an opportunity here does he have another character is he gonna go game and watch once again yes he is okay locking in the joker it's time to 
Let's have a repeat of this match. Same stage, Game & Watch is out. Here we go, game two at Congo Saga. Snooper versus Tweak. Yeah, that's what I'm expecting game two to go, uh, or at least the flow of game two to be a little bit similar to, to game one. Unless we see a, a big change in Tweak's aggression, I feel like Snoop is still going to be playing uh, more or, or, or more neutral heavy game. Yeah, Snoop has to be really careful about how he you know, comes out from ledge because Tweak is spacing himself so that way he can just you know immediately react after he tries an aerial to get back on the stage. See, look at now he's just waiting on him, just uh, anti-airing him. And see, that's how he died twice last game. So, mm. I mean, even look at the the way where Tweak is positioning himself on the stage when Snooper is in the air. He stands underneath the platform in case uh, Snooper, like a lot of game watches, will opt for the down air. He's either going to land right above him or right next to him, and then that's a free punish for Tweak. Go. Now, Snoop, like I said uh, earlier, Snooper, he just has to be just a little bit more aggressive on this just because he's down the stock, so he can't really, like, uh, you know, I understand that he's trying to play safe, but, like, the, the amount of risk you have to take kind of increases when you, like, you, you need to get a lead back. Yeah, the playing a heavy neutral in a slow game definitely benefits the, the player who's, who's ahead, and right now this tweak. And unfortunately for, for Snooper, he's the one that's like really committing to options first, which is allowing Tweak to just whiff punish or weave around and get the follow-up. Okay, up smashes. Not going to connect. Falling guns going to allow Tweak to make it back to stage. Yeah, you see Tweak is just kind of nickel and diming him with guns and uh, these uh, low commitment aerials. And Even right there, Tweak was in a position where... Uh, Neutral B wasn't going to connect, so he just started shooting him up. No. Right, and you see him just kind of microspacing back and forth, back and forth. Going to be able to recover here, and the back air going to kill Game & Watch. But I like what Snooper was going for. He forced Tweak to get off the ledge because of the Neutral B, and then went for a down smash, which is going to cover Neutral get up and roll at the same time. So he had the right idea. I like what he's going for. Right, and Snooper actually just has to, he needs to just outright kill this man. Yeah, but Arsen is back, and this is actually the time to try and get the kill on uh, on, on Joker, on Tweak. Yeah. But very unfortunate for Snooper, he allowed him to grab ledge, and that's not where you want Joker to be. Wow. And that actually flanked with that, and he still got the hit for it. Another back air. Ooh, watch yourself. Okay, a couple of gun actions. Run up, up smash. Mm, that lion tamer coming oh. out from Snooper. Very nice. Yeah, Snooper popping off a little bit. He got one stock. That might be the momentum that he needs for this game, too. Really get something started. Ejection C going to send Tweak to the skies. A little up beyond that. Very, very well done. Uh, let's see. Man, Tweak just kind of just going through the motions right now. He's like really doesn't have to commit to too, too much. Mm -hmm. A hot connection. That's going to be another 20 that eventually happens on Snooper. You see he's slowly rising the up smash. Not going to be enough. I think it was like one more second. It probably would have killed. Yeah. <laughs> okay, knew we wanted to do something on him. So he uh, up at the shield. Another up at the shield. Okay, more up air than Rebel's Guard. Mm -hmm. Making a little bit safe. And that Rebel's Guard lasted a long time. And now Dad's home. Yeah, absorb the entire multi-hit of the Nair. Now shoot him up, falling guns. f till across stage, not gonna take it. Even though on Game Watch is so light, 140%. Next hit should really be the stock and the game. Okay, we see like my man Snooper showing a little bit of resilience right now. Yeah, another up B, and now that Arson's out, uh, he's gonna have access to the counter, but when you're throwing out up air, it's probably not gonna do too much. Down throw? Oh, forward throw. Goes to the forward throw here. And I mean, Snooper hanging on for dear life. And as I say that, he is exited into the black zone and tweaking the handle that 2-0. All right, so Tweak advancing in bracket. And Snooper, you know, he got a, he got, he got a socks. He got, yeah. he got socks. Look, not to say that, That's, you know, that's more than what some people can say. You know what I'm saying? It's Tweak. Yeah, it is. So tweak. this is Tweak, a man who we pretty much all expect to be top eight, if not top four. So, mm -hmm. oh my goodness. And this man, this man, Kara Flags, he having the time of his life, bro.